Welcome to my YouTube automotive channel. In today's video I have a 2012 uh, GMC Terrain and I will show you how to remove and replace the leaf gate support struts. Now this video will apply to GMC Terrains made from 2010 all the way up to 2017. Okay, now you have two different ways how you can uh, remove the old leafgate support struts. First way would be to completely remove the mounting brackets which are held by two torque screws. So one here, one here and same thing on the top here. So two screws. Now this is the the longer way to do it and in this video I will show you how to do it actually the quickest and the easiest. The struts themselves are uh, not being held by any screws, they are being held only by these metal rings, metal clips which are uh, locking it in place onto this small ball here which I will show you later once I remove it. And the same thing down here, so only a metal bracket which has to be removed. Okay, now to remove these metal brackets, all you need is a small flat screwdriver, just pretty much to pry it out. Be careful not to lose it because this likes to pop off. So once you have it removed it uh, a bit, Okay, just use pliers to completely pull it off. Okay, just like that. And you will do the same thing down here. Okay, so these are the brackets and what you want to do next now there is nothing else holding this um, leaf gate support strut, so just want to gently pry it off of the leaf gate. Okay, this wasn't really gentle, but that's the idea. Now you can see here that this is the ball I was mentioning before, so the leaf gate support is. Uh, mounted on top of this small small ball small hook and that metal bracket is actually locking it in in place one more quick tip before I end this video um, before installing the new leaf gate support struts make sure to have everything ready so don't have to do it while you have uh, while you are holding holding the leaf gate. So you will see here on each side you will have two like small openings, one here and one here on the other side. So this is the opening where this small ring is supposed to slide in. So what you want to do, I'll show you on the other side. You want to get it ready like this for yourself, right? So you don't have to deal with this while the uh, leaf gate strut is on the vehicle so just have it like this and then you will install uh, you will mount this uh, strut onto the vehicle and once it's mounted onto that small hook the small ball then you will just slide this uh, this thing on i've seen lots of people what they are trying to do while trying to install these uh, rings they try to widen them up and just install them like this and then this leaf gate support, support will not hold. That's why you have these two, two small openings here. So it just slides in and goes in all the way and locks in place. So that's the idea. Okay, so I've just installed my uh, leaf gate support uh, back on. And now, like I said, you see, it's all ready. Now I just have to lower this down to lock it in place. And that's it. Same thing here that will make your life much much easier okay good to go 
Thank you for watching this short video. I hope it was helpful and educational. If it was, please like it and consider subscribing to my YouTube automotive channel. On my channel, there is lots of how-to videos, do-it-yourself videos, car reviews, product reviews, and other similar automotive topics.